morning to you. Hey, if you've driven down any major roadway, you've probably seen it car after car after car abandoned on the side of the road. Sometimes they're there for days and it can be distracting. What's the deal? Cars abandoned along the side of the road. Sometimes it feels like they're there forever, like this one and this one up here and that one and this one. If you think there have been a bunch of them, you aren't going crazy. In 2017, statewide, 3,269 were reported to the Highway Patrol. In 2018, that number crept up to 4,115. And this year, totals so far reaching 2,432. As long as the vehicle is not posing a hazard, they have a 24-hour period. That is to move your car. So why do those cars sometimes sit longer? Well, after the vehicle is marked with those bright tags, the clock is ticking. It lets other officers know what's up. It should be checked on after that, but that doesn't always happen. The Highway Patrol doesn't want to tow your vehicle any more than drivers want to see it. But it's when danger appears. Maybe the car is left in the travel lane or a car is not completely off the shoulder. It might be towed ASAP. After all, point A to point B safely is the goal. We do uh, see the impact of what happens when someone hits a, an abandoned vehicle and it, it causes a lot of damage and a lot of times a, a lot of injuries. On top of that, if you do have to abandon your vehicle, don't leave it a target for vandals. Take anything valuable and make sure your vehicle is secure. So here's the deal. Once your car gets tagged, that bright orange tag, you've got 24 hours to get it off the road, period. Don't hesitate. Uh, don't let the highway patrol call in a tow truck to get that done. Go ahead and get that off the road. That way it's not a hazard for other drivers. Now coming up Thursday morning on Eyewitness News, what you need to know to make sure your car isn't left on the side of the road, keep you from breaking down what you need to have in your car and what you need to have checked out.